Hi, this is Celine Bernadette H. Francisco. You may call me Celine, and this is Writing for the Web, an Introduction. According to Bill Gates, content is king. But is it really? Let's find out. Just this Miss Universe 2016, the final question has been, what significant change have you witnessed over the past 10 years? Your answer. True enough, the internet has been very influential in our lives ever since. Talk about the 90s wherein we have this dancing baby and now in our time today, we have so much viral videos, so many people on social media, social media influencers and the like. But where did it really start? That's what we have to look into. True enough, the internet gives us all a chance to play in this field. Everyone, as in you, me, they, yeah, you can play as well. Well, at least you need the tools. You need tools online. So this is why content is really a cornerstone of marketing. As you see, interrupting customers repeatedly with advertising or other marketing messages does not work anymore. Basically today, we skip ads. We skip a lot of ads. We cannot take it anymore. And customer behavior and expectations are already changing. That we have to admit. And you know, everyone has this expectation that everyone gets to be the media already. Everyone gets to be the publisher. You can be a citizen, patroller, or, or something like that. You can voice out your opinions without getting judged. You don't need a lot of budget just to, you know, be the media. You can be the media. You can be a publisher. Put that to good use. So now, what is content? Basically, it's anything created and, up and uploaded to a website. You have words, images, tools, etc. You have your homepage, you have your about us page, you have your FAQs page, product information page, etc. You have your videos, blogs, photos, webinars, white papers, ebooks, podcasts, etc. Content is all around us. You consume content, you read content, you view content, you listen to content. Everything around the internet comes through content. That's why you have to really grab this chance, learn this, and then, you know, be the best content creator, publisher you can be. Now you ask, what's the point of creating killer content? First, well, you want to convert browsers into buyers, right? So this is where you come in, content comes in. You want to turn customers into evangelists. You want them to become rabid fans even. So this is your chance, you know, make them count. You know, content has to be really effective in this case. And then you want to turn them into regulars, of course. To do so, you need to deepen re your relationship with them. You need to create content that they will care about. And you want to encourage them to engage with you, to sign up for, your, for the things you want them to sign up for, to download your content, to share them with others, to comment on them, and basically to interact with you most of the time or even all the time check out some pages and see which of these contents work for other brands and then you might want to tweak your content bit by bit if you find them to be not that good not to be effective and from there you learn right Basically, creating content can help you attract customers. 
if you want to get lots of customers the key here is to create effective content you want to educate them about the purchase they are about to make if they are already willing to and if they have some resistance you get to address these you want to not only become a salesperson here you want to become an educator and to do that you need to create content you want to establish credibility trust authority you want to become a leader in your field you want to become a brand that can be trusted likewise you also tell your story you get to engage your audience you want them to listen to you and because you care yes they get to listen to you creating content also helps you build a buzz via social networks you know some content that people want to share in, on Facebook on Twitter Instagram etc you want to build a base of fans and inspire customers to love you well yes technically love you and you want to generate in, inspire or inspire impulse buys you want them to check out your stuff share them with their friends and become viral if possible in this case content will really be your armor it can also become your tool to become the best brand you can be how to do so well it's your choice you have to take note of these strategies and come to think of it you need to start now <laughs>